Local officials spent some time in Washington, D.C. this week to talk community growth and commerce. Lily Pesavento sat down with the Vice President of the Terra Chamber of Commerce this afternoon and has details. Lily. Tom, the Terre Haute Chamber of Commerce has big plans for Vigo County and the city of Terre Haute. So big, they went all the way to the nation's capital. A few things on the table at the meeting in D.C. included long-term transportation funds that could include adding a third lane on I-70 that, that would extend through Vigo and Clay County. An increased focus on defense marketing, which was brought up a few weeks ago at the Chamber of Commerce during a West Central Indiana Defense Network press conference, as well as expanding the federal prison. Several community leaders such as Mayor Duke Bennett and State Senator John Ford accompanied Kristen Craig and local business owners to D.C. So it's always a nice opportunity for the chamber to be able to kind of represent the larger agenda, but the individual businesses on the trip to be able to talk about their points as well. Another point brought up during the trip was access to broadband internet in rural areas around the state. Tom. All right, Lily, you mentioned work on I-70. Is there any other details besides adding that third lane through the two counties? So Craig told me there was also talk of adding a new exit off of I-70 towards Terre Haute, as well as some other safety enhancements. Interesting news there. Thanks, Lily.